different comic I'm sure you guys sh should know what this comic is it's called The Walking Dead it's by Image Comics it's um, what The Walking Dead volume 4 The Heart's Desire this is a really good comic I as you guys know I'm totally obsessed with anything zombie movies comics cartoons graphic novels somewhat novels, art, graffiti art, I mean, anything zombie, I'm like completely, totally, utterly obsessed with. It's just something I've always been into, so when I saw this, actually, you know what, this was a gift. My boyfriend's mother got it for me, but I see it a lot in my local comic book store a lot, and she got me volume four, because I guess she couldn't find the volume one. But I read it as soon as she gave it to me and like I got all excited because I never really read a zombie comic like this before because it reminds me of like 1980s zombie slasher movies sort of kind of same type of dialogue in this comic it's like a big reflection on 1980s zombie slasher movies it's it's weird so I think like I fell in love more so with the dialogue than the art, even though the art is really dead on, it's really cool. I like the cover. Let me get into the cover since I'm talking about art. The art cover is really cool. I mean, it's like a collage to me. This looks like just a big collage. The background, I like that it's like a lot of movement in the background because there's two people, you know, they're kissing. And then towards down here is the zombies, you know, glaring at you, staring, and it's just a weird, like, it just reminds me of, like, someone just pieced this together and, and took a photograph of it. It's like a collage type of feeling I'm getting from the comic cover. And I like the font. I like that it's not a traditional, typical zombie font. It's type, it's type of, like, a different sort of, like zombie type font. I mean, i never really seen a font like this on a zombie anything. It has that typical 1950s zombie font where it's like dripping. I'm sure you guys seen in my, uh, you know, videos, I use the same type of zombie font, so. But yeah, I kind of like that they went a different way with using a different type of font for a zombie comic. It's kind of cool. And I like the back. The back is cool. And it's, it's a good quality book. It's kind of thick. It's it's not like a thin book. It's a good, have a good weight. I mean, if you like reading a lot, this is the type of book you, I think I, I would recommend anyone to get if they like doing a great deal of reading. But it took me like, I was being lazy. It took me a month to finish this because I was reading something else the same time I was reading this. So it took me kind of like a month towards a month and a half of me finishing it because I was being extremely lazy and I was doing way too much other reading on the side but the inside is the typical black and white grayscale type of look has no color and that's kind of disappointing because with zombie comics I kind of want to see a bit of color inside just for the pure uh, effect of the zombies you want to see like you know the blood and the gore and the different colors with that because with that like you're missing the color like I think color makes the zombie character look so much cooler and the effect is way better I'm sorry it got cropped off the effect is way better but for you all out there that know what this comic is and know the storyline and know the different type of other volumes to it you guys know like this is a really cool comic and it's a typical zombie story I'm not gonna get too much into the read but it's a good read it's not the narrations to a minimal um, there's not too much, um, backstory. It's not one of those type of comics that flashbacks the past, present, and future type of crap. 
it's 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 makes sense and they don't flash back and it's not too much narration i like comics like that i always like comics that makes complete total sense and it's action from the start to finish and this is what this is giving me when i read it i was like wow this is a great zombie story it reminds me of certain zombie movies and it's not it's not i said it was a typical zombie story but not really but it's a good read it's a good story and you won't get bored it's it's not boring it's a good clean zombie story and you, again you won't get lost it's just one of those really great zombie comics and um, if you guys are into zombie comics the zombie lovers out there I highly suggest you guys pick up this this the walking dead comic it's really good I mean I loved volume 4 I'm trying like hell to get the first second and third one so I could be caught up in what I'm what I've read so far already but um yeah this is worth looking for really so go wherever you guys go to get you guys comics and try and find it if you guys are into zombie stories and um I guess that's all I have to say with this comic. It's again, it's a great comic, so I don't know. But um, thank you guys for watching. Subscribe if you like. Comment if you like. Rate if you like. And um, I should have more comic book uh, reviews for you guys soon. I'm not gonna take forever to do another one. But again, thank you guys for watching, and um, I'll see you guys again till next week. Bye, you guys.